Hey, what's up, everybody? Stefan Georgi here, and I'm joined by Jonathan Foltz, one of my other co-founders in the Legion project. So if you don't know what Legion is, it is a revolutionary new project that uh, combines luxury Swiss watches with 333 unique NFTs and a real world and digital mastermind. And as I see Jonathan already going through the deck here as I start to talk, he's just so excited to get going. But this project really is... Uh, just really like groundbreaking and it's going to change a lot of um the way people do business in the in the space both web3 and kind of just the luxury goods market as well so jonathan what's up buddy how are you doing good man i'm excited to be here with my brother on this lovely sunday morning <laughs> i know it yeah i know i just had a uh, had some coffee had some cocktails last night but coffee this morning so i'm good to go i'm rearing i'm ready and uh, for those of you watching, like this is really something where we're going to take you through our deck, but we're not trying to pitch you. Honestly, this project, as we'll talk about, is already selling out. It's going to sell out. We want to share so that you understand why this is such a groundbreaking business model, why it's having so much success as a what I call a unicorn offer, and to help see where the world of NFTs and the digital physical marriage is going and how you can be a part of that trend. And of course, if you want to be in and if you watch this before we sold out, then we'd love to have you. But those are our objectives with this recording. Uh, Jonathan, you want to kind of go ahead and explain what Legion is beyond what I've already shared here? Yeah, yeah, And why yeah. it matters? Yeah, yeah, 100%, 100%. I mean, so so me and Stefan came together with our other two co-founders, Umair Hadid and Craig Shelley, because we all come from the e-commerce, retail, marketing, direct response world. Um, we've sold a lot of products online. Between all of us, you know, we've done billions of dollars worth of sales, a lot of through social. Um, we've also done a lot of brand new products that the world has never seen before. Um, we also know that masterminds are a key to success, okay? Napoleon Hill's uh, whole entire book and concept surrounds itself around the mastermind concept and what Carnegie was able to do and how he was able to build. And he had a, he said there was a direct responsibility from masterminds themselves. Since we all love that stuff, um, we figured out a way how we could revolutionize the way that masterminds are done and revolutionize the way that product launches are done. And we're gonna see in the future very much what we're doing here at Legion, um, what a lot of people are going to do. And we wanted to create a community. So we all have really amazing communities. And we're like, you know, what if we brought together these communities, brought in some amazing people, you know, seven, eight, nine, ten figure earners that want to learn more about what is happening in the in the Web3, NFT space, blockchain, DAOs, you know, because a lot of people don't understand it, but it is the future. And we're seeing it happen at such a fast rate. It's almost scary. So if you don't even know about Web3 right now, like you definitely have to find out. And we're still at a very important and pivotal point in time where you can learn about it to take advantage of it. So what is Legion? OK, so Legion is a project um, that unites three worlds. OK, so those three worlds are going to be in-person and digital masterminds, the connectivity, the network and everything like that. OK, together with luxury Swiss watches. Another reason that, you know, Stefan, I know, wanted to come in. He's a big watch lover. You know, Craig Shelley, basically, you see, we love we're big watch guys. You know, Craig Shelley has been doing amazing, huge watches for celebrities, um, all kinds of corporate finance companies, you know, and doing strictly and, and from Switzerland itself, high quality stuff, guys. So like these are not Chinese watches. These are not watches that are going to break on you. These are high quality stuff that you would feel amazing putting into your hand, putting it on, right? Um, and then with that being said, we are mixing it with the new technology of NFTs. So a lot of people think of NFTs. They're all, always thinking to themselves, oh, board apes, you know, these pixelated monkeys and everything like that. But the future is not about the pictures. It's about the functionality and the technology that allows us to do things that was never allowed to do before. So that's the exciting part about it. We're mixing digital, physical, and the community factor itself, okay? So we picked 333. Why do we do it? First of all, we do like sacred geometry. So that's a big component of it, okay? So 333 itself is a big part. And we believe this is a manageable because a lot of these projects, guys, are doing, how, you guys know this very well, those of you that know the NFT space, Bored apes, they have 10,000 bored apes, they have 10,000 mutant apes, they have um, 10,000 kennel clubs, you know, all that. And it's just such a huge community. What happens if you have a much smaller community of believers um, in this new world of what we want to create for the world and take humanity to the next level? 
Okay. So these three networks, um, Stefan, do you want to talk about what, what has helped you, you know, like we're, we're building something here more than anything, you know, it's great. We're going to have these amazing watches. We're going to have these amazing um, masterminds, but what's the value for you like coming into this and wanting to be in this, you know, like co coming in as a partner, actually investing into the project in your time while you're so busy. Why did you want to come into this and what's the value for you? For sure. So there's like two cliches that are, everyone's heard of them, but they're just so true. And that one is that your network is your net worth. And the other is that your net worth is really impacted by the five people you spend the most time with or you surround yourself with. And I, I, I never liked five. I think that's, it's true, but really I think it extends to like the 50, the 500, or maybe the 333 such people as well. So really I love masterminds. I love communities. I love growing and expanding my network. It's something that I didn't embrace until my late twenties. And then I've had exponential growth as a human being, as a leader, um, as well as, as an investor and just my, my own financial sort of success has all come from who I know. And it's not just like, uh, it's never transactional. It's always relational, but through relationships and the last, like, gosh, the last six months, I, I kind of started keeping track of it. It's just crazy stuff. Like having, um, dinner with with Peter Thiel and one of the guys running for Senate for the state of Arizona and helping the attorney general for the state of Arizona, hanging out with like Grant Cardone in Miami for a couple of days. Not, I didn't pay for that. I was invited. Uh, just like my event that I did in Austin where I had combined my speakers had done billions of dollars in revenue uh, annually, actually they do over a billion dollars in sales. And so like that brings value. Then there's opportunities for joint ventures, for collaborations, for uh, just all kinds of fun and exciting things where we can create together. So I love that. And I love the world of Web3. There's so much excitement. There's so much money pouring in. There's so many smart people leaving traditional finance and traditional private equity and traditional tech companies and moving into the Web3 landscape. So I want to collaborate with those people. I want We can do amazing things together and I can grow my network and expand it. And I want other people to come join too and be part of that. Because if we all put our effort and our energy and our focus together, we can solve some really big problems. And yeah, probably also have a lot of upside for ourselves too as a community, um, just to our deals and the things that we do together collaboratively. Yeah, no, amazing, amazing. And like, that's the big thing here, guys, you know, like, so the the projects that are, you know, everyone has a different interpretation of what Web3 is. And depending on what section of the business you're doing, you know, I was just listening to Michael Bay this morning, he was saying it's about, you know, creating worlds, you know, in the Web3 space. And, you know, a lot of it, comes down to community. You know what I mean? Like this is a new opportunity for us to collaborate in a way that was never done before. So let me show you guys how and why we're actually revolutionizing the way that masterminds are done and the way that product launches are done. Okay. So this is a question I actually gave uh, Stefan. I told this to Craig. I've actually told a bunch of my buddy, buddies that are holding yearly masterminds. Okay. And people that have yearly memberships. And I said, I'm like, you know, if someone comes to your event and then you have, let's say three or four events a year, Stefan, you know, and someone halfway through all of a sudden decides they want to get their money back. Is, are you going to give them their money back? Yeah, no. I mean, it's like, that's not how it works, right? It's like, you, you got the value. So that's what you paid for. So, hey, you want to give me more money? Like, you yeah, give me more money like to keep going for another year, but you don't get your money back from the first year. Yeah, imagine that you, you, you literally think it's possible um, at some point in time that, you know, there could be a value prop for you halfway in or something like that. And the way that we're revolutionizing that, and I've already asked that to a bunch of my friends and they're like, of course you can't return it. They already got the value and all of a sudden they want their money back. That's not how it works. Um, secondly, you know, it's not an easy transaction. Hey, I'm going to go pass it to my buddy. It's like, no, you bought this ticket. That's how it is. Membership clubs where I'm, I'm in Miami and there's like Soho house and, you know, the standard and all these high level ones, the plan is $25,000, you know, they don't let you trade them, but the way that NFTs is actually completely revolutionizing this. And we're, we're one of the first ones here from my knowledge and what we're doing. We are the first ones. Um, we're allowing people to have this private membership club um, to be able to now be traded on a secondary market. And why would someone like us, the creator or someone else that wants to create this actually be okay with that? Because there's a creator fee attached, right? So you can make it whatever you want. You know, some people are making a 5%, 10%, 20%, you know, but now they're incentivized to allow people to actually sum on a secondary market is very quick. So it makes it an easy decision for a lot of people because they're like, hey, you know what? If I go to the, a lot of people wonder, man, if I get in, am I going to like it? 
guess what? If you could go, you, you pay for it, and then you can actually sell it on the secondary market very quickly without even having a conversation with anyone. You just go ahead and you put an open seat. That's where it's completely changing the game. And you're going to see a lot of these yearly memberships and masterminds, lifetime memberships, whatever it might be, actually be done through NFTs because of the ease of use and the technology involved. Now, yeah, wait, wait, so, wait, wait, let, me, let me jump in there real quick, John. I got a couple of things yeah. I want to throw in there. So, yeah, yeah, just to be really clear for people who are early on with NFTs. And, and so there's like OpenSea and other secondary markets where you you have your NFT, it's in your wallet, like you physically own it, but you can list it and sell it. But what the creators of these NFT projects do, ourselves included, many of them are put into the smart contract, which is one of the reasons why NFTs and Web3 and, and blockchain in general is so compelling is like the technology behind it, including these smart contracts. Hey, every time it, you know, the NFT sells in the secondary market or in a tertiary market or in a, whatever a fourth in area market is right. Like we, we get 10% of that fee. So then we're incentivized. That's why you, when we get to the price, you'll see how it's basically right now, the, uh, the, the buy-in to get this NFT and the watch and everything is, is like way too low. People are almost like freaked out by how low it is. And you'll see that in a minute. But the reason why is because there's a chance for a, we don't know what happened. It could, it could become on the secondary market, much more valuable. It could also go down. We're not making any kind of promise of future gain or whatever, but there's obviously lots of possibility there. And then two is like on the secondary market, we want those transactions because we'll get, you know, um, gain. And honestly, we want people to feel attention where they're kind of like, man, like I'm getting so much value from these masterminds and this community, but also, I wouldn't mind selling it because there's, you know, other people who want it. And, and so there's a lot of cool stuff that happens uh, after the initial point of sale. Whereas like traditionally you sell a mastermind into Jonathan's point, it's like, all right, cool. Now enjoy it for a year. Hopefully you renew for another year. In this case, there's not a renewal. You don't have to buy in for another year if the community does it for another year. So it really changes the game in a lot of ways. I want to just really harp in on that, but then go ahead, man. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No, actually, thanks for adding that. Cause like, you know, having the ability to put these up on a secondary market, when did you guys ever have a mastermind or a conference ticket that you can easily just put it up by yourself, not wait for Ticketmaster, take a huge fee, no no idea what's going on the other side. You know, Web3 is giving us the power. You know, it's like we, the people now have the power in a way that was never available before. So thanks for adding that point there. So I'm going to ask another great question here. Um, the way that product launches have done in the past, I've done a lot of product launches, guys, you know, just through Facebook and Instagram, you know, I'm directly accountable for over $100 million online. Okay. And one of the things I love doing is pre-sales. And I've been very successful with Black Friday stuff and pre-sales with a variety of industries. Okay. And one of the biggest things that I always wondered, and I'm going to ask this question actually to Stefan, and I want you guys to think about this. When a PlayStation goes up for sale for five, $600, and then it goes and it sells on these secondary markets like eBay, Amazon, and everything like that. How much money does uh, PlayStation make from that secondary sale, Stefan? Yep, zero. Zero dollars, okay? Imagine that PlayStation knew that they can have this now as an NFT, you know, this is before the actual launch itself, okay? And then instead of them literally probably trying to keep people from buying so many and all these scalpers and everything like that. Guess what? They now have a real valuation on the PlayStation. So if a PlayStation sold for $1,200, let's say $1,500 on these secondary markets, they actually get 10% of that or whatever they want to create. They can, they can make it 20%, 5%, whatever they want. But now they're getting a true value on the product. Okay. And then ahead of time, they can basically do what is considered a product drop, just like we're going to be doing a watch drop in a way that has not been done before. Okay. So this changes the game completely. And you're going to see these huge companies doing similar stuff like that. Okay. So that's a little bit what's exciting about that. So I'm going to take you guys a little bit through all these different phases and how we are changing the game. And, you know, we would love to have some amazing visionaries and change makers come along with us because this is all about community. Okay, so we're going to show you guys a, a video of a watch that has taken us through Craig Shelley, Swiss made lifetime warranty that has taken us literally nine months so far to create with crazy detail and, of course, a lot of rarity. So we're going to go ahead and show you guys a video now.
So, what do you think, Stefan? So, I got goosebumps watching it. I've seen that video a bunch of times, but I get goosebumps watching it. I think we need a, a Stephen George eye down at the bottom with, with a digital man and Kirk. So, but that's oh, okay. 100%. 100%. Like, We're going to add that. We're going to add that. 100%. I, I get goosebumps. I mean, that's the thing, right? So, I met Craig originally at a, a, the T, TPC event. Uh, it was like a pro am in Las Vegas they do every year. And actually, this ties into our reveal party, which I'll, I'll talk about in a minute. But um, he had a huge, like, huge, like, space at the pga tour i had some friends in e-commerce they were like hey yo like we're gonna go to this event and there's this guy uh craig like shaw who company craig shelley that you should go you know, meet him and check out his watches so i'm like all right cool they're having drinks it's like we're watching a little golf super fun but i'm looking at these watches and i'm like damn these are just really sexy watches and i went from just kind of like going to because a, a friend had a, a space and thinking that it was a huge space. I'm talking like, I don't know how many thousand square feet, like massive. I'm like, this guy's obviously doing really well with his watches, but I went just to get like free alcohol and watch uh, golf. And then suddenly I'm like, should I buy this watch? I want to buy this. I mean, the watches are so sick and they've only been elevated here with what uh, the team has been doing, what Craig's been doing with Legion. The other thing I want to mention about the watches is my favorite part is like the, the hands there's custom movements that there's like a custom Legion movement for the hands. So for these 333 watches, they have a movement that no other watch in the world has, which is so sick because everything here is about customization, NFTs, non-fungible tokens, one of ones, all that kind of stuff. Even the movements are customized. It's wild. And this, these are not, you can tell, these are high quality, like crafted in Switzerland with like quartz, all this stuff. Like I'm not a watch 16, expert. I mean, I love this watch. 16 but, jewels, 16 yeah, jewels. You it's know, lifetime, lifetime it's crazy. It's crazy. The watches are valued at six thousand dollars at least, and some of them go up to one hundred and fifty thousand, which we can talk about. But it's it's wild. And and side note, to get an Legion for those who do want to for the NFT, the masterminds, all that stuff, it's as of the time we're shooting this video, which could change. It is less than what the value of the watch is, which is why this is what I call a unicorn offer. It's crazy compelling, and we'll get back to that in a minute. I just want to open the loop because I am a marketer and I like to open loops. Oh, no, that's like, that's the beautiful thing about it. And, you know, like a lot of people have asked us, um, you know, like, why is it so cheap, guys? They're not used to coming from us. Like my last mastermind, two and a half day event, guys, here at the Fiona in Miami, um, those that do know the pitch mastermind and such, which we had Grant Cardone and we had Kevin Harrington, you know, not saying they're coming to any of our events. But what I am saying is that level of events that we host, you know, that's a two and a half day event, 10 to $15,000. You know, the masterminds that Craig and uh, Stefan do, $15,000 and up, you know what I mean? Like, so, so why would we do something like this? And for us, it's like, we're so excited about this technology. There's the secondary markets possibility um and we're growing a community this is a long-term project guys like this is something that we want to turn into something amazing for those of you that may know the board apes don't know the board apes they went from zero to an 11 month period time a four billion dollar valuation because they built a massive community and the people within the community helped build it you know when did you have a time where a mastermind yearly mastermind that you really 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 get to dictate or say things that are happening in this community or the the business model itself and that's what's happening with web3 okay so with these watches, it gets a little bit more exciting. So, you know, my biggest value proposition for this whole thing, I'm big on network. The network is the key, okay? So we're just adding an awesome incentive that when I talk to, you know, eight, nine, 10 figure earners, a big thing for them is watches, okay? Regardless if you like them or not, it's a big thing, okay? It's not the biggest value proposition here, but it's a huge thing. So we, we decided, we're like, you know what? Let's make this a little bit more fun, you know? And when I told this to Stefan, I know he was like, no way. He's like, no way, dude, when he saw this. So we did something actually extra cool, which if you guys know how NFTs work, if you don't know, there's something called generative art. So it's almost like a lottery of the type of NFT that you get. So what we've added to our NFT drop. So first of all, September 29th is our actual mint day. Right now is pre-sale. If you're watching this um, ahead of time, if it's after September 29th, that means that mint has already happened. Um, and then October 8th is the actual reveal of the NFTs, which will allow you, as you see here on the screen, one of these um, individuals minus our team, our team is getting watches also, and we've actually taken that out of the smart contract um, to not allow us get the turbion for clarity. Um, guess what? One person is going to get $150,000 turbion watch. And guess what? It's a one of one. Okay, so one of one watch. 
Who knows what this could be worth in the future? I can't give it any estimation, but it's super rare. And then on top of that, we're giving out 11, okay, $20,000 elite watches. Okay, that's the price value tag. And these are amazing, high quality stuff. If you guys know Craig Shelley, you, you do that. So that's what's very interesting. So not only are we adding really cool art guys that are based on the Legionnaires, okay? So those of you that do know and don't know, Legion and Legionnaires um, came most prominently during uh, Caesar's reign when he was basically raining fire on the world and conquering lands like there's no tomorrow. He had 4,800 Legionnaires that were broken up in sections of 10. And these guys, the reason we, we came up with the name of, of Legion and you see the portal there, which is the portal from the Web 2 world to the Web 3 world, from the physical world to the digital world, back and forth, because we want to teach people in the Web 2 world to how to get into the Web 3 world and all work together. But the reason we picked the name Legion is because these Legionnaires were unworldly and, and to a certain extent they looked like they were from the future. They had ridiculous armor, these crazy shields that no one had ever seen, these nine foot freaking spears that basically, you know, were not for throwing, they're actually for fighting, and they would conquer armies that were two, three times bigger than them. When another army actually saw them, they were scared of them because they thought they were like literally either aliens or from another world, or they were from the future. They just couldn't believe that they had such crazy armor that was red and uh, yellow and, you know, these crazy helmets and everything like that. And they also had each other's backs to the death. So the reason the Legion name came along was because like, you know what? We are, you know, I'm not going to say we are from the future, but we are very future centric, working on exponential technologies, Web3. And then a lot of us are just trying to learn what's happening. What's the best way to learn, guys? OK, it's to get in and to get in and to understand. You know what I mean? That's the way that I've learned the fastest with my over 30 companies that I've been part of and everything like that. I get into something so I can learn it as fast as possible. So let's go ahead and go to the next one. OK. So let's talk a little bit about the masterminds, uh, Stefan. So you want to kind of talk about this, um, the three events that we're having, obviously the one that's coming up very quickly on us right now, and then the other two masterminds? For sure. So if you don't know what a mastermind is, it's really just a coming together of usually very high level people. Uh, not every master, some masterminds are for like beginners, but generally like the ones we do our world, it's like high level people coming together to teach, learn, share, collaborate, network, support, and essentially lift everyone up with a rising tide. So I have a mastermind that costs 20, actually about $30,000 a year on average. Uh, I've run other masterminds and, and done events where just a two-day kind of mastermind event was $15,000. Craig has a mastermind that's anywhere from, I think, fifteen to 40000 or something like that. Jonathan, you've done multiple masterminds. So we, we love them because again, I attribute a lot of my growth to my network and a lot of my network has come from masterminds. In fact, probably 85% of my, my network. And I've, I've easily can attribute, I don't know, over $10 million of income, just me personally, not anybody else, not a claim for other people, but I can personally attribute more than $10 million of income to masterminds alone. It's really changed my life entirely. So I'm just very passionate about them. I know Jonathan, you feel the same way. Craig feels the same way. Umer feels the same way. So we've got a reveal party on October 8th, which is in Las Vegas. By the way, Craig's the same golf tournament I talked about before. Craig has got a whole space there again, uh, doing all this VIP thing. So the Legionnaires, those who are the 333, are invited to come hang out at the golf tournament before, network, be at like, you know, by the way, high kind of affluence type of place where you'll meet really incredible people. And um no, the actual party on the 8th with, with other legionnaires and special guests and all kinds of good stuff. And then in addition to that, we're going to do two in-person masterminds in the year 2023. Uh, I think we have one scheduled for March and one scheduled for September. And these will be for the legionnaires only, those who hold the NFT and who have been a part of it. And also you know, we may bring in special guests who are high level, who, who can teach or share or who our community would val get value from. We'll also look at opportunities to uh, invest in things together. Not that this is an investment, but as we can, people may do deals together and look at other projects, uh, you know, and, and even launch companies. There's all kinds of cool stuff that can happen. And you may be wondering, well, what about after 2023? And if the project is, is chugging along, like we expect it to, and, uh, going strong, then sure. We'll, we'll keep going because like, it's in our best interest to do it, but we want to commit to doing at least two for 2023. And you know, we'll go from there because we don't want to be people who over promise and under deliver. We'd rather 
uh, under promise and over deliver. And our under promise is pretty epic as it goes. So Jonathan, you want to add in on top of that stuff about the digital community that we're going to be doing and yeah, the digital masterminds? Yeah. 100%, 100%. So, you know, think about it really quickly. You you mentioned something very interesting because, you know, some of the people that have already gone in, which by the way, we already have some ridiculous, amazing people in the community, guys, just to let you guys know, like there's billions of dollars already worth of network revenues, you know, people that have raised capital and everything like that already. Um, with that being said, you know, they asked me, they're like, you know what, what happens after 2023? And I just like Stefan said, it, I was like, look, we obviously have to make a promise that we're all going to deliver. That's what we do. If everyone knows our background and what we've done, we deliver the things that we say that we're going to do. And the biggest component for what for us is, you know, we want to build this together with people. So there is our plans are to have more. But what can we commit to is that stuff. So on top of these three epic in-person events, on top of the luxury Swiss watch, on top of this crazy, ridiculous network that you guys are coming into, not alone with just us, but the amazing people we've already brought in. We have um, 13 digital masterminds, okay? So for those of you that maybe, you know, out of the country, can't make it to some of these events, da, 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 whatever it is, um, we're going to have 13 of them where we're going to be collabing, you know, networking, learning from super amazing experts um, in different fields of the investment space, you know, hyper-focused marketing, exponential technologies, you know, the investment space, you know, things like that. And guess what? The community is going to have a lot of take on that. You know, the community is actually going to be helping, you know, see how we're going to dictate those type of things. And it's going to help us basically do something that is amazing for the world that can be world changing, game changing, you know, technologically changing the way that we do things just like we're doing right now. So, yeah. So what we're going to do now is we're going to show you guys a quick video. This is only one of our past masterminds. So those of you are thinking like, oh, it's a mastermind, whatever. Well, let me show you what we do. Okay. So I was just at Stefan's event. First of all, his event was freaking sick. You know, I have to say, I give it up to you, brother, because his event in Austin was amazing. Super high Thank level. You. You had you had um, the the CEO of V Shred in there, you know, like a billion dollar freaking company. You know, the the type of people he had was amazing. Um, and I'm just going to show you guys really quickly the type of events that we have put in. This is not to say that any of these speakers or the people in here, which is multi billions of dollars worth of firepower, and a lot of billionaires were actually at this mastermind. But just to show you what we do and what we do, and you'll literally see me right there on the screen. And uh, would love for you guys to see what this is. Everything I want, somebody else has it. Everything you want, somebody else has it. It's about connecting with people. It's not about making money. Money's already been made. So it's just the right people connecting at the right time, pitching the right idea. This is what drives people. You have to be ready to seize the opportunities that are going to start flooding you at these mastermind events. Most people don't know how to say it the right way. Most people don't know how to connect. So well done on, on putting a room full of people together to connect. And good, good on you guys for finding a way to get here because there's you know, 6.9 billion that didn't get over here for so <laughs> All righty. So, Dude. you know, that's just an, uh, an example of one of the, that was just one day, guys. That was just one of the days out of the three days that we did that. And, you know, the more that we build this community, the more we'll be able to have more events. You know, you see some of these communities that are building just to give you guys perspective, you know, the collective, um, the board eight yacht club. I mean, the amount of parties, the amount of events that they have and hosting licensing deals, you know, like it's, it just, once you get into the community, you start to realize how much more this is than a private membership club, than a mastermind, than having a watch, something different. And that's why we want people to join on board and see what we're doing. Just get educated about what's happening because this is going to completely change the way that we do business. Okay. So an important part right here, guys, that, that we want to add because we all believe in something better um, is that humanity right now is at a very important threshold and we need you guys and we need to come together in a way that has never been done before because you guys see what's happening in the world. You see what's happening. We're going directly straight into a recession around the world. Things are happening. And what, when, do you need to have that network? Okay. One of my favorite books that I read was called 
Dig Your Well Before You're Thirsty. Okay, literally one of the best freaking books that you can ever read. And what it dictates in there is that your circle is everything and the people around you. And that's why I'm such a big believer in, and so Stefan and our partners and the people that are joining us because they know how important it is, especially as we come upon these times. Okay, so what can we do together to basically help out our own businesses and then give back to the community. Because we don't want, if you if you guys are thinking about just coming in and siphoning like as much knowledge and you don't want to at least give your take and it doesn't matter where you're at. You can be in a very beginning stage of your business model, but you can help and support in some way or another. You know, we're not looking for those people. We want people that actually are going to give the support and guess what? You are going to get it back in such a big manner. It's not even funny and that's how it works. Okay, so just wanted to give you guys that like an important model for us. Okay. So the 30, 333, just to give you guys perspective, there's 333 NFTs, okay? So many of these projects, okay? Look at the collective. They had 1,000. Then they they did like 10,000 Moonbirds. And then, you know, if you guys don't know about that project, within five days, I think they traded 500 million or no, $380 million or more um, in actual freaking revenue through, you know, through Ethereum and everything like that. You know, we're, we're on the Ethereum blockchain, just so you guys know. So we, we decided to only do 333. Out of those 333, there's 321 base watches. Okay. The product uh, launch on those. So just for you guys to know, just very similar to these other token drops, these airdrops, you know, we're doing a physical product drop. This is not a digital watch. This is an actual physical one that you're going to get. That is a huge value proposition, six to $7,000 value. Um, that's going to happen on December 1st. Okay. Just to give you guys an idea. Okay. Um, those are our base watches are going to ship out most likely by the end of the year. And then Q1, Q2, the Turbion and the 11 um, elite watches will be shipping out to the individual. Um, and then after that, of course, you can sell your NFT. You know, most of the people that have come in, if I would say almost all of them so far, None of them have bought these NFTs to like resell them. So we don't have all these guys who are just like, oh, I just want to make a two, three X if this goes up to whatever it might be, you know, like, who knows? I'm not saying it's going to go up or anything, but these people are just so adamant that like, this is such a good deal with these masterminds that like, I just want to be in this community. I just want to hold one of these at the initial, this is the genesis stage of what we're doing of more potential drops also, just like these other projects are doing, you know, the board ace was the genesis. The, the collective was the Genesis and then they have all these other drops after, which then the Genesis people also benefit from them in the future. I do want to say real quick, Jonathan, you know, um, and I do the same thing where I, I say, hey, you guys, you know, all these guys, but there actually are a lot of women in the project already too, yes. who have also, so we would also have some options for watches for women. If, if these watches are unisex, but we get some women like, like the, the face, I think it's what, 42 or 44. I can't remember what the, yeah, 42. Uh, we did a 42, 42 so right. It'd be a little bit better because 48, yeah. 46 would have been strictly men. Yeah. Yeah. So for you, but we do even have some, some more, uh, kind of traditional, uh, women's watch options for you of different bands, but we actually, yeah, we have a bunch of incredible women involved uh, who have already on our team, but also who have, uh, already become legionnaires. So I just want to point that out. If you use the language guys, because, it's like, you know, old, old language Guys, biases, general, you know, so it's like, yeah, but uh, we're not, we're not woke enough to get our pronouns right. But there are a bunch of uh, incredible women in this, uh, in this whole community as well. And I want to just make that very clear and emphasize that too. Oh yeah. Yeah. No, thanks brother. That's actually yeah. important. And actually we have a little small community that started organically on its own called the women of Legion. Okay. So that's already yeah. happening. I know one of them is at least a board ape holder. Um, we have some like very high end women that are coming into this group. Like it's surprising me. I was like, all right, cool. And they love it. They love what we're doing. Um, all right. So I'm going to go ahead and take you guys a little bit um, through the timelines. Right. So I'm just going to repeat it really quickly. You know, so so as the time of us recording this video, we are in pre-sale mode. Um, we ended up doing because of the price of Ethereum going down. Um, the price was 3.33. Um, before Mint, if we see the price of Ethereum going down, I'm going to put this disclaimer up. We may definitely put the price up because we are already so low on the price of what we're spending. Like, it just doesn't make sense. So disclaimer, this may go up. I'm not saying it is. Right now, we would like to keep it at 3.33 ETH because we're building for the future. But I had to add that in there because um, if it goes a little bit lower, we'd have to bring up the price. We'd have and to just to be really, really clear on that, that is not because I'm a marketer right? and a copywriter. So that's there's there's like fake scarcity where you're like oh the price might go up get in now that's not the case here the case here is like it's a six to seven thousand dollar valued watch plus one person is winning a hundred fifty thousand dollar watch and then 11 people are winning a watch valued at twenty thousand dollars plus there's masterminds and all the costs and expenses that go into to running those in production we're doing all this because a we want to just sell this project out and quickly and have it 
uh, succeed and show people what's possible in this new model. And also because again, there's a whole secondary market and who knows what will happen there, including more transactions. So that's why we have the pricing strategy we do. But yeah, if Ethereum were to go down significantly, there's a point where pre-mint, we can still do this. We're going to go, hey, all right, it's got to be 4.44 or 5 ETH or whatever it is, because it needs to make sense still for just like all the hard costs. So this is not one of those fake scarcity things of, yeah. of like, you know, this is like a very real thing that we've debated internally since the beginning, like on our whole pricing strategy and where, yeah, it's continuing to be something we'll, we'll look at as uh, we get closer to the mid. Yeah. 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 And then, and then after, after we sell out, we have no control over it. The secondary markets take on and, you know, we, we already know the network effect is going to take place and already has started taking place. Like we already have some sales that came in that we have no idea where they came from, like zero idea. So we're like, okay, I guess some of these people are telling their friends and like, we haven't even got to the number that we believe the network effect is going to happen. And that's actually coming pretty soon. So it's going to be exciting. Okay. So September 29th is actual mint. That means pre-reveal NFT dropped into the wallets. Okay. So you can see what you have. You have actual access. You theoretically could actually start selling it on the secondary markets at that very time of being. Okay. Um, then we go to October 8th, which is the reveal party in Las Vegas. Okay. So if you guys are thinking about this and, you know, obviously you want to start booking your tickets and everything like that, we're going to give you guys PGA ticket to the actual PGA from October 6th all the way to the 9th, but our reveal party and our congregation of the Legionnaires and everything like that is actually going to be on the 8th, okay? And all that details and everything, once you come in, we'll give you all the details of everything that's happening. And you can always reach out to us also, guys, by the way. Um, with that being said, we have December 1st is the drop, okay? So from December 1st all the way to January 31st, you get the drop. That means that you're able to go into our system, put in your address, you're going to get a ship. Theoretically, you can sell your NFT right after. But the real reason I told you guys that people are coming into the community is because of all the different network that you're coming into, the real world masterminds and everything like that. And you get a, a actual high quality luxury watch. Guys, this is not a Chinese watch. I have to repeat that so much because like, you know, some people are probably thinking like, oh, it's probably a cheap watch. When you see what we have, no one's doing what we're doing right now, especially at the price that we're doing. Everyone actually thinks we're crazy. And that's why it's been a no brainer for so many people in our circles to come into the community. All right. Then digital masterminds all the way from December 15th, 2002 to 2023, one time a month, an amazing one. We're going to have great speakers. We're going to be teaching about like the stuff that is happening and you're going to learn. That's why the masterminds to me have been so important in my entire life is that every time I go to a mastermind, I might learn a new insight that what I was doing is actually the old way of doing it. This is the new way to doing it. And guess what? These guys are freaking moving 10 times faster, making five times more money doing it in this methodology. And all I had to do is come to an event and completely change my business model. It's a big thing. OK, so, well, I'll, I'll quickly go through this. I don't want to go through this too, too much and everything like that. But we have four of the co-founders. Right. So me, myself, I've started, invested, acquired over 30 companies. OK, we're probably with over 500 companies, some of the biggest companies in the world. Um, last year, we got uh, uh, purchased by a public company. I'm a public company owner. So just to you guys give you more perspective, work with high level politicians, intelligence um, and done some really amazing stuff. Um, in the social space, accountable for over $100 million online. And then even like some of my clients and things like that, even more so. That's why I started my own agency back in the days. Um, and I've also had three exits. So I'm also well-networked and everything. So Mayor, um, his agency back in the days, just to give you perspective of like already who are the founders, let alone the people that are around us, right? So his um, agency, which was Off-Road Studios, at, at one point in time, Forrester Research considered them one of the top agencies in the world, okay? Forrester Research, the amount of awards that they won. That's how me and Umer got connected because they were helping us build a social media platform, okay? And they were so freaking good beyond a lot of the American companies that, you know, me and him became really good friends. He came on board and everything. Um, and then do, do you want to do you want to do your own or would you like for me to talk about Stefan Georgia? <laughs> do you, would you like to do your own or <laughs> no, I'm fine to do do my own. I mean, I'll mention Craig first. So we've, we've mentioned him already. Uh, the founder of Craig Shelley Watches, which is a high end luxury Swiss watch company based out of Beverly Hills. Lots of high like celebrities, entrepreneurs, all kinds of people rock his watches. They are gorgeous, magnificent, just beautiful specimens that he crafts. Uh, he also has his own high-level mastermind. He's working on building a whole metaverse system right now. He's a, a serial investor, just a brilliant dude, so compassionate and passionate and driven and just someone you want to know 
huge, huge, huge Craig fan. And then for myself, yeah, I am a direct response marketer. I've sold over a billion dollars worth of stuff, both my own products and for my clients, uh, using copywriting, but also selling from stage, uh, being an investor, all that kind of stuff. I've co-founded nine different businesses that have done seven plus figures in annual revenue. M many of those have gone to eight figures uh, and beyond. And as mentioned I yeah, I'm an investor, I'm an advisor, including in Web3, I'm an advisor to Joystick, which is a play to earn gaming ecosystem project with an over 200, and, I got I think $220 million valuation and already over a $200 million market cap. Uh, it's got some huge heavy hitters there. Uh, I'm doing a NFT project with Chris Voss from Never Split the Difference and uh, Joe Polish from Genius Network and Nick Peterson from the Wolf Den and the Guardian or Guard eco ecosystem. Uh, I am working on, I'm a mentor for the affiliate DAO, which is another innovative project. So I'm a big lover of Web3. I think it is obviously, I think I know it's like the future. It's where things are going. One of my passions is bringing my community of marketers and entrepreneurs and people who are over here in Web2, which is still great. But hey, how do we blend these two together in exciting and innovative ways? And you know, through Masterminds, I feel like I have one of the strongest networks of any active entrepreneur today. It's something I'm very passionate about. And I can't wait to bring that network into what we're doing with Legion and our digital and in-person masterminds. Yeah, no, amen. So if you if you see really quickly, like we're so diverse, you saw all the things that um Stefan does, you know, we I've been in the Bitcoin space, you know, like say from like 2012 is when I learned about it. You know, I went fully down that rabbit hole in 2016. And, you know, like I see similar things happening with those around me. So Stefan, you know, he's really the, if you see the new projects to get into Web3 based. OK, if you see the new stuff that Craig is doing, Web3 based, you know, blockchain enabled and stuff like that, you know, so you're going to start seeing this switch of and you're seeing it out in the world. Some of the smartest people are going towards this. Why? You have to ask yourself that why, why are the innovators of other marketplaces, web to the marketing world, product world, why are they now switching over? Cause they see the writing on the wall. So it's very important to understand what's happening and learn um, now so that you're ahead of the curve. Okay. All right. So what comes with all these NFTs, right? So you've heard it a little bit more, you know, if you, if you purchase an NFT, what are you getting? Okay. So you're going to get a luxury Swiss watch base at least, um, six to seven thousand dollars. Even if you guys don't like watches, you know this is going to be something of great value in the future. Um, there's only 333 of them, 321 base ones. You know, there's 11 watches that are twenty thousand dollar value, and one turbion hundred and fifty thousand dollar watch. Um, super rare too because it's a one of one. Okay, very, very, very um, amazing. Um, then you get basically access to our reveal party October 8th. Okay, October 8th at the PGA Tour. Um, the reveals on the 8th was 6 to 9th. You get all that time. There's going to be events all over the place. That's right before one of the Web3 conferences. There's a crypto dinner club the next day. I mean, like our people are so excited just about this one. And they're like, I would have paid um, the amount for the NFT just for this event right here. Okay, let alone a watch, let alone two more masterminds next year, let alone the digital ones, right? So then on top of it, next year, 2022, you have two masterminds, okay, which is basically one of them is going to be in March, the other one's going to be in September, okay? So high-level speakers, collaborations, deals, wheeling and dealing, learning, you know what I mean? And like upping your game with the new world that is literally unfolding in front of our eyes. There's the 13 digital masterminds, which are going to be held possibly on Zoom, somewhere online for NFT holders. Okay. And this is a great way for you guys um, to learn about the community and see who's inside here to help accelerate. If you have a problem, talk to us about it. You have something you need, you talk to us about it. Instead of going to consulting, going to an agency, guess what? Now you have a community of people that can help you and support you in a way that wasn't done before. Very high level people. Like imagine like one of the biggest things people tell me, I'm a huge connector and I'm connected with amazing people. You saw that mastermind that I showed you there. So imagine myself with someone like Stefan with his network, crazy. You know, the guy was just sitting with freaking Peter Thiel. Okay. Like that's, that's impressive stuff. Then you put Craig into the mix and Umer, you know, then the people we're bringing in the people that they know, you know, our network has just exponentially grown just from starting this project alone. Okay. Let alone if you guys are joining on board too. Then from there, we're going to add perks. We don't want to stop here, guys. We're going to add so many more things, but it's definitely going to take the community to come in and help us build something amazing. And then the benefits will go to all the legionnaires. You know, it's not just the founders that get um, benefits from this. I mean, you see the, you'll see the price. Once you see it, you're going to be like flabbergasted. You know, a couple of my friends, once they, we, we did one of our first ones, you know, they're like, dude, I literally was ready to pay like two to three X 
And literally, I couldn't believe it. It just didn't make sense. And it's like, you guys, and I'm like, look, we're building for the future. There's more to come. This is not a short-term play. There's four founders too. So with that being said, let me go ahead and give you guys um, the information. So boom, Stefan, do you want to, you want to chat about this one really quick? I love your yeah. voice when it comes to this type of stuff. <laughs> For sure. So, you know, we're in the pre-sale right now. Mint is on the 29th, but if you're in and you want to get one of the 333 NFTs and watches, which will either be minimum $6,000 value up to potentially that Turbion, which is, you know, if you think of the odds, one in 333 people will get the Turbion. Basically one in 33 will get the $20,000 $20, valued watch and everyone else gets a $6,000 value watch. But right now, uh, as we're in pre-sale mode and pre-mint, the price is 3.33 ETH. I don't know the conversion on that right now, but it's got to be what, maybe $5,200? No, the not price even. I think we're literally right under $5,000, which is insane. Insane. Like, we right. didn't expect the prices to be like this. I think we're like at 1470 or something like that. I mean, uh, ETH right now. Yeah, yeah, no, no, it's like 1420. So we're like at 47, 47, 4800 dollars per as of the time of recording this yeah per nft <laughs> but again and we that's why we might increase you know it to 4.44 eth or 5 ETH, whatever it is before uh before mint but because because that alone right so the watch is valued at a minimum of six thousand these masterminds are my mastermind like i said is, is like thirty thousand a year uh you know craig's got the same thing john has got the same thing and so two and a half day all, event was 10 yeah. and 15k craig's are uh, like 15k and above so it's like it's Almost crazy. some people are like, this doesn't make any sense, but it's like, you know, we're, we're here building something long-term and we almost in a way I, I was telling Craig, cause you know, some of his people were asking him, I was like, dude, this is like a gift right now. This is a gift of us, you know, showing you that we want to build into the future. Cause if we don't build into the future, there is no benefit from us other than gaining this crazy badass community, you know, but go ahead, <laughs> Stefan. No, for sure. And so, yeah, if you are in and you want to get going on it, then um, you go to wearelegion.xyz forward slash yes. You can obviously buy it with Ethereum. You can also use US dollar and fiat, which is great. You can do both from there. It also has a summary of what you're getting on that page as well. Uh, if you need help, if you're like uh, not super versed with wallets and NFTs, we've got an incredible team. Often Bella from our team is the one helping out. Uh, do you you know Bella's email address? You might as well just say it on the the, the um, thing here, I think but... an easy way, yeah, an easy way for you guys to get in contact with us is through info at wearelegion.xyz. So if you see our website, wearelegion.xyz, info at wearelegion.xyz. I was actually going to try to write it on here. Maybe we can add it later. Um, but what's important to know is that if you guys have questions, you know, like how to open up your wallet, that stuff is easy once you understand it, but we'll teach you guys, guide you guys. You know, we're not one of these projects that has 10,000 NFTs or whatever it is. Like this is a tight knit community and we have yeah. a lot of the resources through our companies to be able to support. So yeah. Yeah, we'll get you into the discord. We'll get you like where you can get support there too. Uh, all that good stuff. But Really, like again, we're not gonna make this some it's not like a like a pitch a thon on this, but if if there's only 333 of these, we've already had a lot spoken for. We're gonna be pushing really hard over the next couple of weeks because you know we wanna get this sold out and let the secondary market work its magic and we wanna focus on uh crushing this reveal party on the eighth. There you go. I see him pulling up the uh that's the main website, which is sick. But uh yeah, I don't I mean, so you can see the real website or the real website, but like the the you know, main website. And then of course, forward slash yes for uh, grabbing it as well. And uh, Jonathan, go ahead. Yeah, no. So, I mean, I was just showing the website to give you guys a little bit more insight. And if you guys wanted to follow our social, um, so up in the right-hand corner, you'll see Discord, you'll see the Instagram, and you'll see Twitter. And then obviously, if you want to, or you're ready to purchase, go ahead and put buy the pre-sale now. Um, and, you know, you'll find out more information through here. Just go and check it out. It's a very interactive website and everything like that that you guys will check out. Um, and these are a little bit like the NFTs. We're giving you a pre-taste of what they're going to be like, Legionnaire Wish. And guys, we have world-class artists literally working on this. Like, it's not like we're like, oh, we're going to do a little membership. You know, like there's a project called Admit One. All it was is a little ticket. You know, ours are real, like literally are taking a lot of work and effort from our guys. And I have to give the big ups to, you know, the guys helping on this, Assad, Jeff, you know, and obviously Umair. 
huge work, but you know, if you guys are ready to purchase, um, we're ready to have you guys in and build this. You could buy it on the website, we are legion.xyz, or you also press yes. And then that way it'll take you basically to the different pages. You see everything right here. Boom, you could buy with ETH and you could buy it through fiat right here, 3.33 ETH. And you know, if the price of ETH goes down more, there's a good chance that we're gonna raise the price on the ETH. And again, not a scarcity tactic. It's just, we literally can't go lower than where we're at now for everything that we're offering. So yeah. Stephon, any, any last words and everything like that? No, hopefully you found this valuable again, whether you join or not, I would hope you, you know, if you are able, you can join because this is really one of the, I, it's like the best value stack for any offer I've ever seen. It's insane. Right. And the only reason we're able to do that and create so much value with the watches and the masterminds and all that for such a low price of entry is because of Web3 and NFTs and secondary markets and a whole strategy that's that's really possible. If this was not NFT driven or Web3 driven, we could never price it like this. So just understand that. So it's pretty cool to think about, right? The, 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 the only reason we can price it is because of the beauty of this whole new world. And we want you to come into this whole new world because whether you're a marketer, an entrepreneur, and uh, investor or not, that this is an investment, but you're an investor in, uh, you know, like just that, that general sense, um, you know, you're someone who's already involved in Web3, like this is really the way to get deeper into this whole universe, to have understanding of what's going on, be clued into not just this project, but future projects that we were doing that others are doing. It's wild. So uh, we are a legion.xyz forward slash yes. And then if you need help or have questions, info at we are legion.xyz. And we would love to have you in our community. And um, yeah, just glad that everyone took some time to watch this. Hopefully you found it really valuable. Yeah, guys. No. So we appreciate it. You know, thanks, Stefan. You guys see what we have, um, all the value stack that's on top of here. Uh, you're not going to the projects that we've been talking to that we're we're forging some partnerships with. They also just can't believe the price, but it's the early stage of doing it. And there's a backing of the founders. We're doxxed. We've all done a lot of stuff in the business world, highly well-known, respected um, everywhere. Um, and we would love for people to come in that want to bring the value and see the future and that want to go along this journey with us. You know what I mean? It's something amazing um, and build together. So I'm super excited about it, guys. You know, go ahead and we gave you the information. If you guys are ready, just go to wearelegion.xyz. Yes. Um, you have questions, but make sure you follow our, go if you go on our website, just follow us to check out what we're up to and everything like that and learn about this space, learn about the things that are happening. And we appreciate all you guys taking the time to even get to this part of the video. Um, and we look forward to seeing you guys and building something incredible for the future that we all can believe in and something magnificent that, you know, we can be proud to bring our children into. So appreciate that. And thanks, Stefan, for being my boy on this. You know, we always come in and have fun doing these. <laughs> Of course. Absolutely. Cool. Thanks, everybody. And uh, hopefully we'll see some of you inside of the Legion community soon. Bye, everyone.